Hey everyone, I'm Kyle Peck, and this is Cyrex Productions. It's 2018 now and the time for New Year's resolutions. But while not everyone will follow through on those goals, there can be possibly high risks and possibly high rewards if one can play their cards right and put on their poker face. This is my review of the high stakes gambling film, Molly's Game. Molly's Game is a dramatic crime biopic based on the memoir of the same name, written by Aaron Sorkin in his directorial debut, and starring actress Jessica Chastain as Molly Bloom, a former Olympic skier who built an exclusively dangerous poker game for Hollywood stars and Russian mobsters, unknowingly, and becomes an FBI target during her decade-long journey. Sorkin, who created the TV series The West Wing and wrote the films A Few Good Men and The Social Network, plays at his strengths for directing plots with smart and quick-witted minds that note the tiniest details in mid-conversation that are eventually key in the end, and picks up those pieces regardless of whether one catches it or not. In fact, the film peaks when forming suspenseful competition within its elements of wordplay and trickery throughout the poker games and powers that drive Molly forward. But there are fragmented segments outside of that that are good in some areas and forgettable in others. Speaking of Molly, Jessica Chastain's performance as the self-sufficient and rational poker princess is exciting to watch, whose opportunistic instincts and sheer will drive her obstacles to the end, which was enough for Chastain to be nominated at the 2018 Golden Globe Awards for Best Actress in a Drama. Actor Kevin Costner as Molly's brutish father and psychologist Larry brings some key moments that reveal his fair internal mind outside his cold, rough exterior and Michael Cera was the most surprising and brief standout as Player X, a celebrity poker player that desires to take out his players in real life and not just in poker. Lastly, Idris Elba as Molly's sharp lawyer Charlie Jaffe is proficient in playing off of Chastain with Molly's legal battles, but while their chemistry maintains enough engagement and character growth, their ongoing drama becomes stale when Chastain and Elba are just playing that power struggle between who's right and wrong. All in all, Molly's Game presents a solid entry for both Sorkin and Chastain in producing an authentic drama with Molly's journey. But there are missing cards in its deck between the faults of its short script and rusty screenplay. I give Molly's Game 8 out of 10 stars. If you like my videos or reviews, please subscribe to my YouTube channel at Cyrex Productions. Or you can find me at my Facebook page called facebook.com slash Kyle Peck fanpage. I'm Kyle Peck, and see you next time.